Hey, folks, tomorrow night, State of the Union address. President Biden reportedly going to highlight his efforts on the nation's economy. But you, if you ask Americans, 41 percent said they are in worse shape financially now than when the president took office. Let's bring in our panel, former New York City Records Commissioner Brian Anderson, host of Money Talk with Melanie, Melanie Collette, and Jupy strategist Ford O'Connell. And I'm going to call an audible here about talking. I don't care about State of the Union. I, I do care about some other politics. I think if I watch Peyton... Manning, I got to yell out Omaha first when I when I call on them. So uh, I'll go with that for it. Here's what caught my attention today that the uh, Koch Foundation, Charles Koch, it, it looks like they're going to start spending money to try to defeat um, Donald Trump. They had stayed out the past couple election cycles, but now that's changing. Is that going to matter? I don't think it is going to matter. Obviously, the Koch Foundation is not big fans of Donald Trump. They need to understand that the GOP that they used to represent is now a party of Main Street. And Donald Trump is the person, particularly on foreign policy when it comes to blue-collar workers, that has the ear of the grassroots of the Republican Party. So I'd say this is a big mistake overall. Yeah. What do you think, Melanie? No, I tend to agree with Ford on that. Although, I, I don't think that President Trump's Winning the primary, I know Ford's going to hate me for this, uh, is, is, is assured. But, but surely uh, those donors removing themselves is probably a bad idea. Yeah, it's interesting, Brian, because the way Mr. Trump got through the last time, there were, what, 16 other candidates? And yeah. he took them off one by one because he'd get his 33 percent or whatever. Uh, but everybody else got 8 percent and then they're gone. Eventually, he's, he's at the end. He would love to see that scenario this time. But sure he would. Will it? I mean, he'd have a nickname for everybody on the, on the panel as Only well. the ones he considers a threat. That's true. If That's you don't true. get a nickname, you don't matter. That's true. But the Koch brothers, this is a little disturbing. Uh, they have a lot of money to spend. And we all know it's about the media. Uh, so it, it, it throws a curveball into things. It does make it interesting, because last time I think they stayed out. They didn't necessarily spend it against Trump. But now they're talking about actually right. engaging that. If the panel will stick around, we have more to talk about. Uh, coming up, including a black professor who called for the, okay, the killing of white people to end racism. That's the way you would end it. But now his supporters say he shouldn't have been fired. That's racist. I'll explain more of the story. Assuming all this is true, hard to believe.